How many times do I have to tell you you cannot be chasing police cars around and flying this stupid drone? Look here, buddy. I gotta tell you something. I'm an FAA pilot, and I need you to stop talking to me like that. Okay. Mr. Luck and Batch? Yeah, that's right. Okay. I see that that is official, but I can talk to you any way I want to. No, you can't. You know who my daddy is? <laughs> <laughs> So basically the plan is to chase my friend's police car with the DJI Avada over this bridge here. Now I'm not going to fly over the bridge yet, but I'm waiting for him to show up. In the meantime, what I'm going to do is get set up. This should be kind of fun. Something new, a little excited for it. Be like assertive, like scare me a little bit. How many times do I have to tell you you cannot be chasing police cars around and flying this stupid drone? Look here buddy, I got to tell you something. I'm an FAA pilot, and I need you to stop talking to me like that. Okay, Mr. Luck and Batch? Yeah, that's right. Okay, I see that that is official, but I can talk to you any way I want to. No, you can't. You know who my daddy is? <laughs> <laughs> I put an NB16 on here. All right, I got Shane on the phone. I am I uh, got everything. Uh, connected and we're ready to take off. Okay. Are you good? Yeah, I'm good. I'm just waiting for you to tell me Go what ahead. to do. Go ahead. You can speed up a little bit. Okay, Alright, you're going a little too fast here. Yeah, you went a little too fast, but that's okay. All right, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna turn around. Uh -huh. I got a stupid notification mid-flight with the drone saying, "Oh, you entered a warning area." Why? Like, why would it tell me that mid-flight? Where'd you turn around at? I'm here at Bridgeview Dental right now. Oh, okay. Still have good signal. I didn't go under the bridge yet, but. Okay, here we come. All right. Just uh, start going on a good speed. Let me know when you're close to the middle. Okay, I'm keeping about 20 miles an hour. How far are you behind that truck that just went by? Uh, quite a bit. Uh, I'm approaching the middle now. Oh, I see. You can just turn in whenever you want. That was so bad because I got that stupid warning. So I just, I could see where I'm going, but all I see is con press confirm. Well, I gotta put my hand off the joystick to do that. Did it stop your flight at all? No, I was able to go, but it was just like, okay, well, that's not fun to see when I'm trying to fly. I wish I went underneath the uh, the bridge, but I'm so nervous, man. You want to? I can do one more pass if you want to try something. I'm at 64% now. Just start going now. Just turn out now. I'm going. Just go. Just go as fast as you can. signal gets so weak the second I'm under the bridge, man. It's gotta be all that metal. Yeah. Alright. I mean, at least I didn't lose it fully. 
but still, it just goes from full bars to just straight red. Now that one was different. It was cool. It's just, it's broad daylight. You can't tell what's going on. You think you feel awkward. I'm, I'm standing here in front of a camera with the goggles on. All these people flying, driving by. I didn't get the footage I really wanted. I was hoping it'd be a little more cinematic, but the important thing was I didn't lose signal. And that's the main thing I've been worried about. You can see as soon as I go underneath the bridge, it just completely dies down pretty good. Still a little nerve wracking. Nah, still a beginning. Nope, uh, denying that, but that's fun. It gives me hope for the future. Every time I don't crash, I'm like, I just got a little bit better. Pretty frustrating to be honest with you. The fact that it said made me press confirm, I just lost all hope. One day I'm going to come out at night with this cop car and then just do some orbits around him with his sirens on or his lights on. I think that'll be cool. For now, that's all we get. It's still a cool experience, but losing the signal by the bridge like that, that is just unbelievable. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see another skit that Shane and I did, click this video up here. It was pretty fun. Had a really uh, great day. That's the day my Avada went under the cliff and then lost signal. So that was a uh, pretty nerve wracking. Check that video if you didn't watch it. Other than that, I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.